a lot of um, people say Winky Wright and Vernon Forrest would have gave um, Floyd Mayweather problems. I see Winky Wright. I see. Um, I have a fighter that will give. I believe would have gave Floyd Mayweather more problems than Winky Wright and um, and um, what the nigga name is. Um, Running for us. This guy is the grandmaster, Joshua Cloudy. He fought everybody, Floyd fought, and beat him in beat him in, in better fashion. And he just had a style that would have gave even a young, pretty boy Floyd uh, a run for his money. He was strong. He was like stronger than Kodo. Cold, you see how Kodo fought? Mayweather bust him up with that jab, but Mayweather was beating him up. But Cloudy got better defense than Kodo. He's stronger than Kodo. And he got a better jab than Kodo. And he got a he and he threw more combinations and better combinations than Kodo. He hit harder than Kodo. He would have gave Floyd Mayweather problems, serious problems. Manny Pacquiao, I believe he was paid to throw the Manny Pacquiao fight. He played with Manny Pacquiao. You got to pause that. He treated Manny Pacquiao like a kid. He just, I believe, and once he fought Manny Pacquiao, he disappeared from the sport for a couple of years because I believe Bob Earn paid him off. You could tell the way. That wasn't the same Joshua Cloudy that we used to seeing. That wasn't the same Joshua Cloudy. He just stayed on the ropes and let, it was so many openings. You could see that he wouldn't, he wouldn't pull the trigger on. So I believe he was, he was paid to, paid to throw that fight. Just go in there and play defense, though not mess with the money fight. Probably got a probably got a million off of that shit, and just got low. His style would have gave. Now, now you see how he, he backed himself in the corner on purpose, just to just to take a look, just to just to give Cotto a different look. Ate a few shots, but look, he just doing this to get a different look. You know, watch how he explode. Sometimes he go to get rest, get looks. He he uh, he's looking, he's looking, he he's looking for openings, and watch how he he jump right back in his regular style. He caught that, he caught that, he caught that. And that one got through, but Kodo was very strong. Kodo was very strong, but look how he look. He see the opening. He see the opening, and that's what that's through the defense. That's through his defense. He he, he check. That's another way of getting openings. Is change your look and, and tighten up just to see what the person throwing, so you can get your shots shots off. That's advanced. That's advanced. That's setting traps on a very high level. He did that to set up traps. Put his guards up there to set traps. Now he he's, he knows exactly where Cotto head gonna be at when when he make a move he he, he beats Cotto to the spot and getting off a lot of uppercuts clean right hands he was the master the grand master Joshua Cloudy I believe if anybody would have beat Floyd it would have been him because that of his style look he quit look at that he quit all that he quit all that. He quit all that. And he's doing this to get looks. He's doing this to get looks. Sometimes he take a little break. Now, when he go back at Kodo, watch you see what's open. He see the openings. Kodo, Kodo, Kodo switches things up. So, he go and find more openings. Kodo, Kodo do a readjustment. He go get some more looks and see what, and readjust to him. And find out exactly what Kodo's doing. Reading, reading. Where is where he gonna be at? How can I hit him and he not hit me? And watch he hit him and get out of there. He set up his shots and get out of there. I believe he would have gave Mayweather a bunch of fucking problems. Just a whole bunch of problems and could have hurt and could have hurt him. He had power. He fucked Kodo up. He fucked up 
Diego Corrales. He fucked up Sam Judah. He fucked up a lot of people, man. He fucked up a lot of motherfuckers, man. The Grandmaster. Joshua Cloudy. His style was crazy. Any one of those forgotten heroes that people don't talk about. People don't do videos about him. But this was a bad boy in the um, late 90s. Early, no, the, the mid, the early 2000s. Late 90s, early 2000s. Joshua Cloudy was a bad motherfucker, man. He's not forgotten.